amo, te amo, porque te amo, mm, te amo, porque te amo, oh, te amo, porque te amo, estoy enamorado. to our room we have a fan here and then in in that um, round I want to say storage like size table we have uh, slippers extra blankets and hot water bottles and then this is our beautiful 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 uh, look at those side lamps I think those are my favorite <laughs> those are my favorite lamps and this place has many many lights a lot of light and then we have that if we did all unfortunately but when you visit you will be able to and then over here we have another side table um, and I think this is sherry I had a, I had a, a sip and it almost knocked me out because I'm not <laughs> I can't handle alcohol and then here there is um, I have a very personal note to me and my family wishing me a lovely stay basically and then to the right um that stunning stunning couch with that beautiful beautiful view um and then another really cool part about the room is this fireplace for the cold nights uh the guy did tell us that it gets quite cold and foggy during the night so this will come in very handy but this is our bedroom this is basically let me do a 360 of our beautiful bedroom as you leave the bedroom you enter into a i say like a lounge type area i guess um we have a bin and then we have a chair very creative looks like a bucket <laughs> and there's a tea station here with a variety of teas milk and cookies um and then glasses there another beautiful light Stop. walk into the last segment of the cabin which is the bathroom let me try and get a, a better shot of that so upon entrance this is what it looks like um, we have our two sinks there um, hand wash hand lotion and then we have a really beautiful mirror then we have face cloths, some tissue, and then the safe for our valuables, and a basket there, I think, for anything you might want thrown away. Or oh, nah, maybe dirt, no, dirty towels, I think. Uh, yeah.
sausage. I'm having one egg, one sausage, bacon, a croissant, some cold meat. Jess is having an omelette and a lot of bread. I want to video this. Oh, yeah. it's oh, that's why it's so easy to destroy. Yeah, and I think we started to have uh, you are not there. Uh, these few months we have Namibians that came here. Uh -huh. So the ladies they found out something that the powder that's for the face scrub or for face. This, yeah. So a lot of the million ladies that were here they, they took, took some for always <laughs> a big wet. It is very nice for, for, for the face. Be, even themselves if you apply on your skin it make you to feel a bit like a relax is it yeah it make you just feel better so <laughs> now a lot of people are telling just it. take a break oh yeah keep.
very refreshing nap after our drive. So, yeah. Let's go see what's for dinner tonight. No ice cubes for me. Yeah, I'll get that. Um, then, do you like a uh, fire little room? Yes. It helped a lot last night. Thanks, man. I went over the place. Thank you. Muscles. Muscles in. Muscles in delicious sauce. <laughs> shuttles you back to Maui Bay and they treat the shuttle as the last activity of your visit so there you get to um, see some shipwrecks and take pictures and I think the last stop is the museum before you eventually get to Maui Bay oh the lighting in this cabin is just is beautiful so yeah we are about to have breakfast now and then after that we head on off so our last activity and then finally Moby Bay. Um, I just wanted to give some facts on the lodge that may be useful. Um, it is quite far. It's quite far. It's about 800 kilometers from Ventuk. So the best thing to do would be to have a stopover. Most people do it in Damar either in Damaraland or Swakopmund because then um, we took the Hentis Bay route, which is what the Swakopmund does take i'm not sure about the <coughs> i'm not sure about sorry i'm not sure about the damara land route but you do hentis bay uh, and then you get into the park skeleton coast park you do Tora bay terrace bay and then moi bay that's how you get here um it's about four let's say 350 something kilos from hentis bay so it is doable in a day if you wanna if you wanna push that stretch but you get here quite tired uh, we actually might do a stopover in Sokopun before we get home. Um, the lodge does not have a pool because it is very close to the ocean wall. <laughs> if you drive. We we walked to the ocean yesterday and that's never happening again. Um, it has family units. It's family friendly. You can come here with your families. 
our stay was just it's beautiful come here if you want to see the skeleton coast if you want to experience this part of the country the stuff is amazing the food i think quite probably the best i've had in the country the food is it is amazing um so yeah many many things to experience so if you really really want this to happen for you you can even reach out to me and i will plan it for you bye you gave me the letter i guess it was july you said we'll be better but i don't know why i should be so Imagine you're mine